in this lecture i am going to share mass energy equivalence principle what is the meaning of this principle this principle says mass and energy are interconvertible means mass can be converted into energy and energy can be converted into mass next question is from how much mass which amount of energy can be produced for that purpose a relation was given by einstein the relation for this principle is e is equal to mc square means if we have mass m it can be converted into energy of amount given by this relation where c is velocity of light in vacuum velocity of light in vacuum that has a constant value that is 3 multiply 10 to the power 8 meter per second this relation is called einstein's mass energy equivalence relation and this principle that mass and energy are interconvertible is called mass energy equivalence principle if somewhere an amount of mass m disappears then equivalent energy e will appear and this energy is given by m e equal to mc square this can also be stated as if energy e disappears somewhere then an amount of mass m may appear and this amount of mass will be given as e over c square from the same relation means mass gets converted into energy here energy is converted into mass in order to have more understanding about this mass energy equivalence relation let's take an example suppose we are asked to calculate energy equivalent to a mass equal to 1 amu means if m is equal to 1 amu then what will be value of equivalent energy how to calculate amu means atomic mass unit that is very small unit of mass first of all let us recall the definition of 1 amu 1 amu means atomic mass unit is defined as 1 twelfth the mass of one carbon atom and how to find mass of one carbon atom if we have one mole of carbon atoms i write mass of one mole of carbon atoms divide by the number of atoms in one mole in one mole so we can calculate mass of one atom 1 over 12 multiplied with mass of one mole of carbon atom is equal to 12 gram and number of atoms in one mole of anything it is equal to avogadro number 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 so this will give us 1 over 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 gram 
that is the value of 1 amj so we have proved 1 amu equal to 1 upon 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 gram after simplifying we can write it equal to 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 24 gram we can convert it into kilogram 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 27 kilogram it means we are given m is equal to 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 27 kilogram we have to find value of energy by using the ratio e is equal to mc square m is given 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 27 multiplied with c square in SI units value of c is 3 into 10 to the power 8 it is to be squared after simplifying we can get energy equal to 14.9 into 10 to the power minus 11 because we are calculating in SI units so units of energy will be joule so so much energy will be produced if we have a loss of one atomic mass unit means if a mass of one atomic mass unit disappears then so much energy will appear 